Fearless Funny Shine? Hmm. Fearless Funny uh, Fun Shine says, We try! And if that doesn't work, we try again! <laughs> Cloudseeker is yours to pilot. <laughs> yeah! Bye, everybody! Bye. 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 Well, take care. I'll miss you. back soon as we're gone and he's fixed that junk jalopy of his she is right his name is bluster ages ago he made a deal with the elder care bears he'd stay out of the silver lining and the bears would leave him alone it appears he's broken the agreement care bears we have a new mission protect the wiffles so they can do their job of growing carolot a mission to save the silver lining and save Carolot. And stop that bluster guy along the way. Oh, yeah. Moses. Definitely. Would you look at that? Majestic mountains, beautiful lakes, spectacular waterfalls. Good place for a vacation. <laughs> Dibble! <laughs> is, is everything okay? Dibble! Dibble! Home! Home!
but two. Nibble first. for showing me there is so much more to the world than color. Something I learned from this little lady. It's what's inside that counts. And right now, I could use a rainbow smoothie inside me. Me too! Me three! <laughs> sometimes we were silly, sometimes we were serious. But he thought that playtime was all the time. If it was up to him, we'd never have any fun. He was always acting silly. He got us into big trouble. Oh, no. It got so bad, we began to magically change from one to the other. He's always goofing off. And he's always trying to stop me. Oh. Oh, why can't you leave me alone? Oh, why can't you behave? You're a bully. You're a goof off. Mag Clown. <laughs> oh, buzz off! Not till you behave. Wait, please. You need to accept each other. There's time to have fun, and there's time to tone it down. He'll never learn. He'll never listen. Look, I'm a no-nonsense kind of guy. But even I know you gotta kick back and have fun sometimes. No one likes fun more than me, but there are times when you gotta buckle down and do what you gotta do. Go ahead. You can do it. Well, I'll try if you will. <laughs> yes! <laughs> <laughs> From Riffle Sub, the Clatter Track moved us happy. Clatter Track group friend to Riffles. So glad to see you. Ooh, thanks. <laughs> the right place, the right time. Mission accomplished. Times two. <laughs> Are you all right? Dibble, okie dokie. And look, looky. Bestie. Yes, she found all it. right. <laughs> Who are you? <gasps> Be Bess? It is my bestie. My, I haven't smiled for so long. I forgot how it felt. <laughs> oh, I, I feel so giddy. I don't know what to do. No, wait. I do know. <laughs> no more collecting. No more cataloging. No more keeping, ever! Good oh, for you! Go. Right. But what will you do? Why, I'll become the Finder! I'll return all these things to their owners. But first, there's something I need to do. <laughs> <laughs> ever seen Anyone as happy as Dibble when she plays? <laughs> so fun! <laughs> Not until now. <laughs> Idea, Dibble. You go, Dib! <laughs> <laughs> Quick! Bear Pyramid! Cool! Yes. All right! <gasps> <laughs> <laughs>
kiddo. First stack of grum cakes to the guest of honor, our hero, Tibble. Speech, 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 speech! Tibble not hero. First too small, then too big, then too small again. Just goes to prove, it's not how big or small you are, it's what you do with what you have. And you did great. Oh, yeah, Dibble just the right size. But didn't get to Billy's. Not to worry. Easy pickings. They don't call me Mac the Lumberjack for nothing. And they don't call you Dibble the Great for nothing either. You're my hero for sure. Carrying control. Cloud Seeker calling. Can you hear us? Power's boosted to the max. We got him! Just barely. Oh, sorry. Sorry. If you can't bear stare. Grass. Ahead. What's he talking about? I don't see any grass. Is he sending us on a bogus road again? My gut feeling is he's right this time. I think we should trust him. Let's try the Care Bear Stare. On what? On whatever's out there. Ready? Go! <laughs> Sorry. That's all right, bedtime. You didn't know the pages were stuck together. My love of jelly, um, got you in an awful jam, so to speak. <clears throat> you were right to ask questions, Chair. I do have one more question. Do you think the Whiffles could spare a seed of caring? I'm sure there are more than enough. Why do you ask? I know a spot that could use a little extra care. Good luck and fun shine. Hey, guys! I'm over here! Funshine, where's good luck? Uh, I, um, sort of kind of don't know. You were supposed to stick together. Well, we did until stuff started moving, and then we, uh, well, didn't. Help! Help! Listen, that's good luck. I hear him. Me too. Yeah! Dude, talk about super hearing. Oh, you can all be my sidekicks. Sunshine, we can play later. But right now, we have to find good luck. I am Stupendo. And I'm on it. Mm -hmm. I won't let you down, bro. Help! Hey! Up here! Oh, oh no! Hmm. Oh, yes. This calls for... Extra Super Stupendo Bear! Whoa! <laughs> Thanks, bro. Whew. Don't thank me yet, dude. I don't know if this is gonna work. I thought of putting it in the first issue, but then I was like, nah, nobody would believe even Stupendo could do it. Do what? Well, uh, this! No! Put it in the first issue, too crazy, in, out, what? Awesome. <laughs> awesome race in there, Rocky. It was fun, but a bet's a bet. I guess me and mine will be rolling away. Thanks for the laughs. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. Bye. Bye. See you Plants. <laughs> 
poor Wiffles. No matter what they do, everything is struggling. Even the master can't keep a seedling healthy. Here, I've got the info. According to the records, while the Rumbler's behavior might be considered rude, it's invaluable to the environment. Their antics turn stony ground soft. Their instincts lead them to find unplantable ground, then they improve the soil and move on. In fact, their arrival is a sure sign that the soil is in desperate need of pulverizing. Ah, oh, thanks, bedtime. That explains why the Wiffles can't get anything to grow. We fail to appreciate the unique talents of our noisy neighbors. You mean I messed up, big time. If the garden is to flourish, we have to get the rumblers to return. That's on me. I made them go, I'll bring them back. Is that what I think it is? Yep, looks like Funshine got the rumblers to race him back here. They couldn't resist the challenge. It'll only be a few more days. When the rumblers are done playing, the soil will be ready. Then they'll move on. You'll dig it, your mastership. Your plants will grow humongous. Good news. Dibble and I have been in the workshop whipping up something we all need. Earplugs. Ta-da! Watch out, rumblers! <laughs> Anybody get the license of the truck that hit us? <sighs> so, you won. Well, congratulations. <laughs> Huh? <laughs> Your wish is now ungranted. You mean I'm not funny anymore? Yeah, only when you want to be. And you're okay with me not being your comic partner? <laughs> it would have been a hoot and a half, but I tell you what. When I was out in the silver lining, I found a whole new audience. You did? It's... The Wiffles! There must be a of them, maybe more. I can tour the silver lining and they'll never get tired of my humor. It's what you always wanted. You said it. Ah! And from you, I also learned a lesson. I won't make them laugh from any magic spell. I'll make them laugh through the magic of humor! <laughs> hey, works for me. Anyone seen Funshine? Where'd he get to this time? Did somebody call for Mr. Comedy? Ta-da! Oh, boy. Will you quit clowning around and get to work? Whew, they didn't laugh. Yes! Oh, thank you guys, thank you! What's that is the best about, thing you? I heard all day! <laughs> <laughs> Everything will be all right. I've brought my bloom bubbles with only minutes to spare. Uh. Uh, careful now. Easy, uh, easy. Uh, no worries. I weighed it down even more, so there's no chance it can float away. Uh, uh. Whoa! Oh, no! Oh, follow the lousy lock! Oh, 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 the clap! Catch it! Uh, uh. A little help? Oh, my bloom bubbles. Oh, my... Oh, they're ruined! I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Look, everyone! They're beautiful. More beautiful than I could have dreamed. I... I don't understand. I think I do. It was because of our friend Good Luck. When he broke the reverse control, it kept us from backtracking and wasting time. Taking the short, steep road was faster than the long, easy road. 
And that crazy noise from the engine helped you find the Cloud Seeker. And when he dropped the trunk, it mixed the bubbles together. And that's what made the flowers so very beautiful. <laughs> Maybe my bad luck wasn't all bad after all. Yeah, guess it wasn't at that. Well, you coming? Before we go get the scooters and take the wizard home, we gotta repair the engine. We? Yeah, you're helping me. 